Did you know that one in four men suffer from erectile dysfunction? Erectile dysfunction usually means that you cannot get your banana up. This condition mainly comes down to two factors, your nutrition and your lifestyle choices. So let's jump into nutrition first. You want to keep your arteries clean, unclogged, to let your blood flow more easily into your arteries. So my first suggestion is to eat clean food. You want to avoid food on a regular that is greasy and full of sugar, therefore that can clog your system, clog your arteries. Number two is to cut back in smoking, drinking, and avoid hard drugs. They're all bad for your sex drive. Now, I'm not saying that a drink or two in a weekend is going to affect you. You just want to avoid it on a regular basis. Next is hydration. I always preach it, and therefore, I'll preach it once again. You want to drink at least two liters of water per day. If you're an active person, I suggest from three to four liters of water. Next, your lifestyle choices. Tip number one is to exercise on a regular. Now there are three components you need to focus on when it comes to exercise to avoid erectile dysfunction. Number one is cardio exercising. Things such as sprinting are going to help you a lot to keep your arteries clean. Number two, resistance training. It can be weight training, bodyweight training, or calisthenics. Most importantly, you want to put resistance in your muscles, therefore create testosterone, which helps a lot in your sex drive. Then, you have to focus on your pelvic floor muscles. Your pelvic muscles are basically the penile area around your groin. You can strengthen your pelvic floor with an exercise called kegels. A kegel is when you're going to the toilet, trying to pee, and then you stop the flow of pee by contracting the pelvic muscles. I suggest doing 50 to 100 kegels with one second hold per day. Next part is sleep. I suggest 7 to 8 hours of sleep per day to keep your immune system and your body functioning properly. Now the last part is to stop watching porn and stop masturbating. They're not good for your sex drive, so every time you're on your computer or on your phone, you need to limit this kind of content at all costs. Now if you still have concerns, feel free to reach me out in private and I'll help you out.